Welcome to the Roadrunner 89 Investment Network, where we talk about interracial love and marriage. Hope you enjoy Swirl to Investment. something. I'm going to give you my opinion and my advice, my observation, my perspective, okay? Now, this is my advice to black women, okay? You know I have love for black women. I do. I say it all the time. I'm married to a black woman, okay? Almost 30 years. May will be 30 years. But let me tell you the observation I see. And when it comes to black women, my advice to black women is get out of the collective and live your life as an individual. Put yourself first. Understand your beauty and value. Okay? So many times black women have a tendency because they have a big heart, they have a, they have a lot of love in their heart. A lot of times they'll put other people first. They'll put other people above themselves. A lot of times they'll put the men they date above themselves, their husbands. A lot of times black women pour everything, their heart and soul, into their relationships. Okay? And, and that's a blessing. That's a good thing. But ladies, you should not have to carry a man or carry the relationship. You should not have to be the breadwinner. That should not be a thing. And, and a man you're with should be able to pay all the bills, pay the mortgage, utilities, pay for the food, you know, uh, clothing, everything. But for some reason, we've lost that. Okay? And, and, and black women, you need to put yourself first. Don't be afraid to open up your options. Don't be afraid to get to know other men. You should never have to date and marry down. But if you stay race loyal and your only option is a black man, guess what? They outnumber you by over 2 million. So they get to say what they want from you. And that ain't right. Ladies, you're too beautiful and valuable to have to date and marry down, to get to a man's level. You should never have to compete for a man. Men should compete for you, ladies. You're too, too beautiful and valuable for that. And, and I know some of you ladies, I, I know some of you ladies like it when I, you know, give love and respect to black women, when I give you a little praise. And, and, and some think it's weird because you're not receiving the love and respect you deserve. It's not weird that I say I love and appreciate black women and point out all the beautiful things you do, that's what a man should do. You should be receiving love and respect. It should not be a, a weird thing when a man says that he, he loves you. He loves what you're doing. He loves the fact that you're getting your education. You're moving up in the corporate world. He loves the fact that you're a traditional woman and you put your family first. Us as men, we need to show women love and respect. And me being in an interracial marriage with a black woman, I should be telling black women how beautiful and amazing they are. Why wouldn't I do that? It's the truth. But ladies, get out of that collective mindset, okay? There's other men out there that will love you. Get with a man that loves you, celebrates you, that deserves you. Your job is not to build a man. Your job is not to carry the family load. 
Your job is to be the beautiful woman you are and to be loved and, and celebrated and taken care of. You should be with a man that pays everything. And guys, we need to step up. Black women deserve the best when it comes to men because they are the best. And, and, and it's just sad that whenever you express love and respect for a black woman, she thinks it's weird because the men in her community are not giving her that love and respect for the most part. I'm not saying all, but from what I see, and you know the black women that are doing the best are the ones that are living their life and putting themselves first. Living their best life. Being successful. Whether she's with a man or not. Whether she's married or single. Come on ladies. Come on black women. You're better than that. You deserve all the love and praise in the world. Don't, don't get... You know, don't don't be thinking it's weird and don't be thinking you don't deserve it because you do. I, I don't give black women love and respect just to do it. You deserve it. And, and I love telling the truth. I love telling people how amazing black women are. I tell my friends, I, I, I tell people I work with, open up your options. You don't know how amazing black women are. And I, and, and I think many black women don't even know how amazing they are. And a lot of black women won't open up their options because they bought into this belief that other men don't like them. And they only, the only chance they have is with a black man. And that's not true. Your options are wide open if you want them. But go... Make your choice. Live your life. Date Mary who you want to. It's about you, black women. You're the prize. You're the treasure. Accept it. Live it. Anyway, that, that's my opinion. That's my observation. Okay? You don't have to agree with me, but this is what I see. Ladies, you're too beautiful and valuable to, to lower your standards for anybody. They should up their standards for you. You're the treasure. You're the prize. Live your life. Anyway, that's all I got. Have a good day. Happy Saturday.